Hello, my name is Adedayo Famodum and I'm currently a CRA level two with PPD. When I started with Winship, the training was not as intense as Fast Track. And I was training with one other nurse that came from the ER and she didn't go through the class. So she had a lot harder time understanding their acronyms, the abbreviations, and I could skip that part and get to the nitty gritty of the SOPs. I feel a lot more prepared that I took the time to invest in my own personal education, to invest in preparing myself for the role. Fast Track was monumental in me feeling less stressed and overwhelmed going into a new role. Eight months, I started with, <laughs> this was so fast, it was, I was surprised. I was impressed myself how quickly I moved. I realized the biggest bulk of my investment with Fast Track was the connections. You guys truly do know pioneers in the industry. In the process of starting my interview with PPD, I contacted my mentor that they assigned me during the program. Right before the end of the program, I recall her transitioning from COVID to PPD at the time. So I just wanted to get an insider perspective. That relationship for me was very monumental because everybody within Fast Track was still reachable. The mentors, they do keep up. When you guys say you truly are part of a family, I felt that. Just the innovations, there's so many new medications, processes, investigational products coming out. It's almost like you're five years ahead of the rest of the population and you know things that may not be public. It just feels great being part of something new, just being part of the future. I was part of the multiple myeloma team. Hematological cancers are one of the most complicated diseases to treat. The trials really made an impact on me in the sense of watching these patients come in with no other options. Everything in the market right now, they've tried, it's not working. Just seeing the family, the relief in the family member's face is the biggest impact for me because my myeloma is a lifelong disease. They come out so much better at the end of the trials. And for me, that's like the most impactful thing just to see these patients go from doomsday to, wow, this hope.